story just sent to us a major step forward in the road to reopening schools in South Florida. Both Miami-Dade and Broward County school superintendents say they are planning to welcome back all students to campus in the fall. CBS 4's Keith Jones is outside the Broward School Board headquarters in Fort Lauderdale with those details. Keith. Yeah, and arguably this past year, 15 months has been uncertain at best. It's been crazy. It's just been uh, very trying at times, especially when you think about the kids who started in school last year. They were all sent home because of the pandemic. This school year, they were given the option of going into class or learning from home. Well, next year, the announcement was made both in Miami-Dade and Broward County that it's 100% in class. Last March, Broward County students went from classroom settings to an online classroom. This school year, most teachers and some students returned to the classroom, but most are still learning from home. Today, Broward Superintendent Robert Runcy made a big announcement for next school year. Broward County Public Schools will open the 2021-22 school year uh, with 100% in-person traditional face-to-face -face instruction at all schools this fall. What that means for all Broward students is the option they were given this school year to stay home or return to the classroom will not be an option this fall. There will be no blended hybrid remote learning um, for students and families who desire a virtual option. Our Broward virtual school has been available for that purpose for the past um, 20 years. In the Miami-Dade School District, Superintendent Alberto Cavallo also addressed next school year. It sounds as if the intent is to have all students back in the classrooms face to face. It is our plan as a school system uh, to welcome back 100% of all of our students across all grade levels, that's pre-K through 12, for the 21-22 school year. Meanwhile, Runcie offered an explanation as to why he made the decision right now. Based on our experiences this past year, which have highlighted the academic, social, and emotional challenges that many of our students have had with the remote learning, and we know some certainly have been successful, but there have been many that it's certainly been a big challenge. All right, so both districts, they acknowledge, look, the vaccinations, the progressions and protocols, they're only going to be getting better before next fall. That lends them a bit of confidence and be able to reopen schools 100% face-to-face in classroom. The teachers union here in Broward County is butted heads with the district. And so how are they feeling about this announcement that we're going to be 100% in class? I just spoke with the union president about two minutes ago. You'll hear from her coming up at 6. Reporting live tonight, Keith Jones, CBS 4 News.